But there is a fundamental principle that's embedded in our, our revolutionary yeah. founding, in the Enlightenment, the inalienable rights, uh, rights of each individual for liberty, for privacy, right. and in the, that the government cannot invade my privacy without some reasonable suspicion. Now, Ryan Lizza wrote a, uh, what I thought was a compelling piece in The New Yorker about whether the president would reign in the intelligence state. Here's something he writes. The NSA's collecting of data looks a lot like what Facebook does. <laughs> but it's fundamentally different. It inverts the crucial legal principle of probable cause. The government may not seize or inspect private property or information without evidence of a crime. And what the government has been doing is putting together a haystack yeah. with no reasonable suspicion. Well, I would have to challenge a couple of premises, both in how you formed the question yep. and how the article was written. All right. We're protected against unreasonable search and seizure. All right. It doesn't say that all searches must be based upon reasonable suspicion. So now unreasonable search and seizure depends upon the totality of circumstances in which you find yourself. And, and, and David, I, I fully admit, look, Snowden was important. He accelerated a debate. I think he misshaped the debate, but he certainly accelerated it. But the debate was coming. Look, there are three things that are changing. Number one, the nature of our enemy is changing. It used to be nation states. Now it's individuals. That requires tremendous granularity that you didn't quite have to have when the problem was the Soviet Union. The second thing that, that's changing is technology, and, and that, that seems to be self-evident. Mm -hmm. The third thing is an understanding, a cultural understanding, as to what constitutes privacy and a reasonable expectation of privacy. Look, privacy is that negotiated line between ourselves as unique creatures of God and ourselves as social animals. That negotiation continues all the time and it's actually accelerating right now. So you have NSA trying to deal with all three of these tectonics moving. That's really hard.